Oh, hello there. Aren't you beautiful today? Jesus. You have been working out, haven't you? You look amazing. Ah, anyways. Welcome back. How was your work day, darling? Oh, yeah, I've already got your drink ready, right here. I wouldn't want you to wait another second. You would waste your invaluable time, my darling. <laughs> yeah, well, I already know you come here every day after work. And order this exact same drink. And that's for three months straight now. And I enjoyed every second of it. <laughs> Do you want something else then? I guess I'll just keep this to myself then. <laughs> alright, alright. Ah, you've been nice. So, here you go. You know, I was wondering if you were coming here today with someone special. Perhaps from work or somewhere else, maybe. Hmm. <laughs> oh, if you were coming at all. Why? Well, <laughs> just look around you. Me and Marco worked so hard decorating the place last night. I feel like I haven't slept at all. Did I? Well, it doesn't matter. Your radi radiant beauty just keeps me going. <laughs> and it gives me all the energy I could ever need. Ah, yes. That's right, sweetheart. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> and, for guessing correctly, you've won yourself a special prize. Limited edition heart-shaped straw. Just for you. <laughs> well, yes. Technically, they are for all customers. But, if I were in charge, they would be special for you. <laughs> Ow. That is workplace harassment, Marilyn. <laughs> okay, okay. Enjoy your drink then. Next, please. Yeah. With extra cream. Sure thing. Everything for you, lovely darling. <laughs> and aren't you radiant today? Well. You should be, you shouldn't be here, you should be in, in a model studio or something like that. You look incredible. Is it like that? <laughs> oh, wait, give me a second. Excuse me for a moment, sir. Marco, can you run the register for a moment? Thank you. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, have some napkins. Why don't you get yourself clean up? I can help you if you meet me. No, don't worry about the mess. Why would you think about that? I mean, look at him. Ah, you are more important than that. And don't worry, I will take care of it all. Oh, your hands are shaking. Are you sure you're okay? You sure you didn't burn yourself? Well. You shouldn't be worried. Your beauty isn't tainted by anything. How could it be tainted by anything? <laughs> well, you know what the washroom is. Right. Why don't you go over there while I handle things here? I will take you out that on. And don't worry. You look absolutely stunning. Even with a couple of stains. And I surely don't mind. <laughs> so, get going. And here are your orders. Anything else? All right then. I'll be taking my leave then. Thank you so much for ordering at us. And I hope you will have an amazing day. Marco, I'm taking my break, okay? I think I need a bit of rest. <laughs> oh, hi. What are you doing just peeking from there? That's quite adorable, though. 
I forgot to say. You look cute. Actually, you're like a little puppy looking for attention, aren't you? But it's okay. You're the most adorable, cute, and beautiful little puppy I've ever seen. <laughs> well, I'm here now. Is there anything else I can help you with? No need to blush like that. Oh, right, yeah, you're close. Yes, uh, I bet it's uncomfortable to be walking around with a wet stained shirt on. Well, tell you what. I have my hoodie in my locker. Um, I would kindly offer you to borrow it for a bit. How about that? <laughs> yes, of course it's fine. I've had it clean recently and I didn't wear it much, just wore it to go to work. Well then, let's go. In case someone else wants to use the toilet, we don't want to keep them off, right? That might be a bit inconvenient. Mm, don't worry. I know the sign says authorized personnel only, but I hereby dub you the authorized. <laughs> Now come in. Don't worry. It's just like any other room. I think it's alright. It still smells like my cologne. <laughs> yeah, put this on. Don't worry. That thing has been through worse. <laughs> I fell into a puddle of mud once while wearing it. I rushed my, my arms open, even though it took quite a beating. It still looks decently, does it? And of course it's clean now. I wouldn't let you wear my dirty clothes covered in mud and blood. <laughs> I know, my clothes are barely worthy of your godlike presence. Your angelic beauty. But I have nothing better to offer. I'm sorry, my lovely goddess. Still, you can have it any time you need it. <laughs> that looks adorable though. I think it, it, it looks good on you, actually. I might just let you keep it, because it suits you a lot more than me. <laughs> okay. I would have much preferred you keep it, so I know you have something of mine in your possession. Something to remember me. But well, if you insist on returning it, then I shall await your arrival tomorrow, as usual. What? Wait, why won't you be there? Are you working late tomorrow? Oh, then, what is it? Come on now, you can tell me. I will never refrain from hearing your angelic, silky smooth voice. <laughs> your hands are shaking again. Are you okay? You are not feeling anxious, are you? Is it about you spilling your dream? I tell you, we all make mistakes, it happens. And it didn't taint your beauty in any way, shape or form. And you know, people will forget about the incident soon enough. Everyone is too confused on their own lives these days. And I'm sure the only thing they will remember are your beautiful eyes that you can lose yourself in any second. <laughs> Me? Wait, am I making you uncomfortable? <laughs> Am I too close for your liking? No, not at all. Are you sure? I heard I can have that effect on people. I know I'm a bit of a charmer sometimes, but I, I think I have a special liking on you. Flirty? <laughs> yeah, I'm supposed I'm a bit flirty. But if you're not comfortable with that, then I can certainly stop immediately. I wouldn't want to make you uncomfortable. Please excuse my behavior. 
it'll take some getting used to and I would have to watch myself, but don't be afraid to glare at me if I say too much. Every little sign helps. Wait, with others? You don't like me flirting with others. Is that it? Oh, I see, I see. Could it be that you... Wait, why are you crying? What did I say? I, I, I am so sorry. I, uh, I... Special. No, wait. I, I'm sorry. Wait. Is, is that so? Uh, I'm sorry. I don't think <laughs> anyone has ever confessed to me before. I, I'm not used to people being so sincere towards me. I, <laughs> waiting for the chance with me? No, no, that's actually not the case at all. You're, you're actually the first one who has ever confessed to me like this. Ever. I don't do this just because it's my job or because I want more tips from customers. The reason is so different from that, actually. Listen, I'm sorry that I hurt your feelings. And I mean that. I would have never wanted to. Never. I didn't realize that you felt that way about me. Actually, I think I have to be honest with you as well. Ever since the first day you came in here and I, <laughs> well, tried to make moves on you, you got all quiet and flustered. I, you adorable. But you ran to the back of the cafe and just sat there in silence and avoided all and any eye contact with me. I guess, <laughs> I guess I was a bit embarrassed and I, and I thought you get annoyed by me. I decided if I was like, like that with everyone, then you wouldn't think it was a big deal. I didn't want to make you feel like you're not special to me because you are. And I, and I guess it worked because Gradually, you started sitting closer and closer to the counter, and I really enjoyed that. Your view is only rivaled by the most beautiful sunsets I've ever witnessed. And every time you came in here, I got to know you more and more. I just ended up liking you more and more. But, well, of course I like you. I, I thought I was being obvious. <laughs> All right, yeah, I, 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 I guess my flooding with other customers would be giving you mixed signals. I am not that smart sometimes, am I? But I really do like you, and only you. I try to remember what your favorite order is, and your hobbies, and all the tea at your work just so I can talk to you longer. And I enjoyed hearing every second of it. Your voice just being so silky smooth and every bit of it just continuously flustered my heart and filled it with joy. And now that I know I've hurt you, I really, really want to make it all up to you and show you that I really do care. Well, since you said you wanted to return my hoodie as soon as possible, maybe I could pick it up at your place after work. Um, and maybe I could pick you up as well. Yeah, and then maybe we can go somewhere where I don't have to serve customers <laughs> and where I can focus. Just on you. Does that sound good to you? Really? That's great. I'm so excited. I promise you, 
you're gonna love it. And just for something official, would you want to be my Valentine for today? If you don't have anybody, I would be delighted. I will make sure to make it up to you for tomorrow. We can extend our personal Valentines a bit if you would like to. And you deserve both days anyways. Something as great and beautiful as you, something as smart and adorable, deserves everything. Then I will be looking forward to seeing you again. I will be there. See you soon, little darling. <laughs> I hope you will be having a great day, though.